punish children because we're blamed for it because it's like, well, if, you know, if you tell um, daddy you'll go to jail, you'll break up the family, and that's what makes us all sick. And the TV star details her claims in the new People magazine as well. Her parents categorically deny it, and they have now taken a lie detector test. Joining us from San Francisco this morning, Roseanne Barr Arnold's parents, Helen and Jerry Barr, and their attorneys, Melvin Belli and Kevin McLean. Good morning. Thanks for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Mrs. Barr, do you deny all of the allegations your daughter has made? Any allegations that say I molested her? Uh, sexually or incestuously, I deny 100%. Mrs. Barr, why do you think your daughter would accuse you of those things? I don't know why. I don't know why. Has anything happened in, in your relationship recently that, that would sour the communication between the two of you? Yeah, I yes. guess her ratings have gone down. Yes. My daughter hasn't spoken to me since a year ago, May. Mr. Barr? Yes. Do you have any idea why your daughter would be saying these things about both of you? No. None at all. We're totally upset. We're, we're crushed. She has made Mr. Barr some very specific accusations about you, saying you molested her, saying you forced her to fondle her, fondle you. How does that make you feel now that those accusations have become public? How would it make anybody feel? I never touched my daughter. I never had any ancestral relationships with her. And we don't understand. Mr. Bell, I know this is a very tough time for, for the family. Yes, and it is. And in the is. middle of all of this, uh, you have asked the bars to take a lie detector test. Yes, because uh, we're not going to sue anybody in the family. Domestic relations law sometimes is pretty sleazy, particularly in San Francisco. Some of the judges and certainly the domestic relations specialty. Family can't sue daughter or siblings, and I wouldn't bring a suit like that. But I've told them unequivocally, Anyone who publishes a defamation, which is false and which is obscene and is destructive of this one, they should be sued. So we're going to consider People's Magazine and all the rest of them who spread these things about the daughter shall not be joined. She has to live with this herself as to what she's done. She wants to take a lie detector test. She's welcome. I'm not her lawyer. These people have taken their lie detector test with the best man out here, best philographer that I know of. We've used him in other cases. He said, absolutely clear, absolutely innocent. They never touched, they never molested, they never locked her up or anything like that. Anyone else that wants to take a lie detector, you, t you people, People's Magazine, anyone else, they're welcome to do it, provided it's a good philographer and a man who knows what he's doing. They're completely innocent. They're devastated. They're now talking to me about, shall we sue the people who, per uh, who, who perpetuated uh, these lies, about suing the daughter, we have nothing to say about that. I'd like to see the family have a reconciliation, if at all possible. I think all things are possible, almost all things, I, and I think this I'd, is. I'd like to talk to Mrs. Barr about that. I, I know how devastated that your whole yeah, family has been by these accusations. Could yeah. you ever conceive of a time where there would be a reconciliation, where you would sit down with Roseanne and talk to her about what she said? I have called Roseanne repeatedly and I've asked to be, that we sit down with a therapist and discuss whatever was going on. Absolutely. She is my daughter. Mr. Barr, do you think you would be emotionally capable of, of sitting down across the table from her and, and trying to talk through this? It would be a tough job. It would, but he's Kevin willing to McLean. try. He's definitely willing to try. The main uh, impact of our statement today, and this is all the only statement the bars really want to make, is that they've taken their lie detector test to prove their innocence. They didn't want to drag this on any further. Instead of sitting back and, and enjoying the, uh, the uh, notion of, of innocent till proven guilty, they've gone out and proven their innocence. 
and People Magazine has shown their uh, reckless disregard for for truth in journalism. I mean, the cover of this week's People Magazine looks like the National Enquirer. It, Mrs. It, it's Barr, in, in closing this morning, Mrs. Barr, uh, I know you said you would like to sit down with your daughter and, and talk to her. If Roseanne were listening this morning, what is it that you would like for her to hear from you and from your husband? I would truly like to see her heal, not talk about it, but truly reach out in love and heal within a family Our in door a proper is way. Open. Mr. Barr, you have a daughter is here Mr. in the studio Barr, I, with him today. I, I, I'm sorry to cut you off, Mr. Bell. I, Mr. Yeah. Barr, you were saying that the door is always open. Our door is always open. Well, I, I was saying the, the other daughter is here in the studio with them today. She feels devastated, too. Yes, the family is in total support of the parents over, over these, the, the terrible way that this issue has been handled by, uh, by People magazine. Well, we appreciate all four of you joining us this morning, and uh, thank you so much for... I could say hello to you. Okay. Thanks thank so much. Thank you, Paula. Thank you. We're going to be right back right after this. This is when I love Great Nut Cereal. I've been out here all morning, and I'm still going. Does your cereal do this? Try breakfast with Great Nuts for a week. I did, and I 